TFNN. Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Welcome, folks. We have the uh, Dow Industrials finished down 84. You have the Nasdaq up 15. S&P's up 2. If we look inside the Dow Industrials, what you're going to see out here, folks, is that uh, it was all about Boeing taking the Dow south. Uh, Boeing put 118 negative points inside, inside the Dow Industrials today. Dow ended up being down 83. Uh, putting positive points inside the Dow is that you had Apple putting 21 positive points. Home Depot putting 10. Procter & Gamble putting 9. If we go over to Apple and we take a look at Apple, what you're going to see out here is that uh, the, Apple's got a little traction. You know, we have a market out here today with really light volume. Uh, bottom line is that Apple did 25 million shares. Now you're coming into... 42 million, you got over that level, but you did have a small expansion of price. So I suspect Apple's going to try to get up to ice, which is approximately, well, actually, we're right, we're right at it. Now, two, 206. Right now, you're at 200. 206 is the number. We're going to take a look at the um, SPY, what you're going to see in the SPY. Volume continues to contract. You don't have the buyers out there, but bottom line, got another 23 cents higher. Contraction of volume, 44 million. 44 million is going into 214 million. And the X100, same setup. The, the Qs, they peaked their head up uh, higher again. Uh, 22 million shares uh, out here. You know, last week, uh, even anemic volume was 31. Small caps continue to be the weak link out here. Small caps just can't uh, get any traction. Sideways move out here today, down 28 cents, actually. Light volume, uh, didn't reject lower price. Uh, inside the IWM, you're talking 159.50. Uh, that high was generated out here on the 25th of February. Gold contract, uh, gold continued higher after rejecting lower price last week. If we take a look at this gold contract, what you're going to see uh, right now, we're trading out at a price point of 1301. You did 200,000 contracts. Uh, this contract looks like it's going to make a run to 1356. Silver, same setup. Silver, as well as gold, rejected lower price last week, had light of volume on the rejection, uh, all of the above. And what you also had is this, in fact, that let me bring up the oil market right now. Because you had oil, gold, silver, iron ore, copper, all moving higher. When these base metals move higher, oil moves higher, commodities move higher, folks. Bottom line, you just very well may have a commodity bull that, that's happening out here. Oil's at 64.44, and guess what? 70 is going to be game now. Big numbers. Stay right there, folks. Going to be coming back with some numbers after the close. To recap, we had the Dow down 84, NASDAQ up 15, S&P's up 2. Come right back.